demand for power generation and its distribution are at the heart of China's Belt and Road Initiative. Hong Kong's V Power Group is a leader in a new type of power business. We are in the distributed power. Uh, we are very close to the customer, the user. Unlike the large scale power plant, you rely on a very, very large infrastructure in order to support the power supply through a transmission line. The business has been likened to toy Lego building blocks, the critical factors being flexibility and mobility. In many of these emerging countries, many of them are within the Bell and Road Initiative countries. They don't have the sophisticated or adequate infrastructure to support this type of large-scale power plant development. They spend money in power generation, yet they lose about 30% from the generation to the end user. So we fit in that usage and fit in that desire by the Bell and Road Initiative countries. Conventional power stations are long-term and costly projects. V-Power Group has invested in a new breed of power supply to replace outdated transmission lines in countries like Indonesia and Myanmar. We actually sell power to the government, to, okay, and then they are the ones who distribute the power to the industrial zone, to the residents. We fit in the desire for these Dell and Road Initiative countries because they could have a bit of budget and financing that they could do, let's say, for example, a smaller scale 50 megawatt, then they can do it like right now. Later, if they need more, we add on. Just like the advantage of Lego toys, V-Power supply generation can be used when and where it's needed. So the business is not about single projects in single countries. If you look at our power station, Basically, our investment in that power station, almost 90% of our investment can basically be redeployed and moved away. We basically we can move and redeploy our fleet of power stations. So that fit in with the Myanmar's and like people like Indonesia. For more mature markets like the Chinese mainland where V-Power Group is highly active, there's a different driver for distributed power with the accent on renewable, cleaner and more efficient energy use. Not only electricity anymore, they want uh, cold water, they want air conditioning, they want steam. Across the wider Belt and Road, the power Group sees large-scale demand for its services and products to get projects moving. Now with the Chinese government uh, Belt and Road Initiative supporting this country or investing into this country, may that be toll road, terminal, airport, power plant, whatever, what would be needed immediately, our type of power immediately. To bring such power generation to life, Financing, investment and control are vital and it makes Hong Kong a pivotal point. We are the ones who centralize and consolidate and coordinate all this effort into one package solution and offer to the Bell and Road Initiative. I think that's the critical part that makes us competitive. When we put in an adequate structure or a contractual structure to make it happen, that's what we do the best and that's what Hong Kong does the best.